Okay, so now that I've shown you how to add a different URL for better website um, clicks from your Google My Business page, we can see if that data matches up with what's in the Google My Business Insights. So for an example, uh, for my company, if you scroll over the website link in the bottom left of the screen, you see outcarriercompetition.com backslash question mark UTM underscore source equals GMB page. So now if I were to go to my Google My Business page and take a look at Meaningful Marketing the last month to the 30 days, it says I've only gotten 31 visits to my website. But if I go into my analytics under channels, I should actually take that back a step because what you'll see is when you go in your analytics, you'll want to go overview and then under all traffic and channels you'll see it's called other um, I don't have the default um, channel grouping set but if you go to other and click on other you can then see GMB page so that's the last seven days but if I were to go to the last 30 days and hit apply I can see that I've actually had 54 visits as opposed to what Google says which is 31 so they've actually understated quite a bit almost double now I did this test on another clients account <clears throat> and you can see that Victoria Transmission Auto Care they've had according to Google 76 visits from our Google My Business page uh, from their Google My Business page to their website if we go under analytics all traffic channels go into other we can see that over the last 30 days I've actually had 87 visits from their Google My Business page instead of 76 so never trust the number that the Google My Business Insights says and rather set it up so you actually have a tracking URL that's tracking the clicks on the website link of your Google My Business page